Get ready with us to go get Mukbang Monday! We're gonna go get the food and we're getting raisin cans. Highly requested. Okay, here's the deal. I don't know if we should get the big bean sauce. The cup, cup. yeah. Like, I need to know so uh, we can get it right away. We need the cane sauce. It's an essential. Okay, Esme loves raising canes. And when I say she loves raising canes, she's obsessed with it. She even, like, dreams about it. And all my friends be sending me the videos of raising canes commercials. Like, why are you trying to make me hungry? So, in the next video, I'm gonna eat a lot. Like, <sighs> mostly her. Y'all have no idea how much I love boo. If y'all really love this video, we're gonna go bigger. We have to match for the mukbang matching mukbang mondays we are cheesy but you know i don't care we're queso frescos if we were cheese we'll be queso fresco somos chismosa the lemonade is the best thing there and i know you're a fan of that the thing is like they charge for refills like why are you charging for refills chick-fil-a will never we devour the bread no as me does nope coleslaw extra, extra bread. bread i'm actually glad we're doing this because my mom never buys me raisin canes unless i ask my grandma I mean, what are grandmas for they pay for everything yeah i'm gonna tell you my order i get the four count the four count no coleslaw let me repeat no coleslaw extra bread and the lemonade with extra cane sauce we might have to get it actually and actually <laughs> dip it in the cane sauce you like just watching mukbangs makes me hungry i mean if you know you know oh i know i know it's me you eat a lot but you know it's okay you more to, to love me? more to love no more to love let me just put some summer fridays so ready for this okay let's go to raising canes adios get ready with us to go to olive garden in a rush because my dad told us last minute like two minutes ago he told us to get ready in 10 minutes i mean we're already rushing but like 10 minutes <laughs> i'm really excited to go to olive garden because i devour olive garden let me tell y'all like we don't even order the drinks first we order the breadsticks always asking for refills before we get our food okay we're low-key really excited to try out this one size primer because the packaging looks Look amazing okay speed it up we gotta go you know you go there too much when the waitress already knows your name like all of our names these are olive garden orders okay so i actually get the adult menu because i eat a lot and i'm getting the chicken parm and i get the chicken alfredo with spaghetti not fettuccine and i replace the chicken with chicken frita and extra alfredo sauce on the side and guys y'all need to try their appetizers like their mozzarella sticks the bomb.com okay i eat like 30 breadsticks in a row how many breadsticks can y'all eat no she really can especially with the noki soup mm. this week was like really hard because it was exam week and i really really need this Okay, when I was little, I used to think, like, Olive Garden was very fancy, but, like, I really don't think it is now. We're in our sweats, for goodness sake. I still sake. think it's fancy. <laughs> I just used the shade, the Elf Blush in Bronze Bombshell, and it low-key is good for, Ooh. like, little bronze. Hey, hey, slay. I bought this from Sheen for the first time ever. It's, like, this lash shit, and it was only, like, $2. My husband is already saying two minutes. <laughs> I like this, like, lash separator she got for, like, this whole set. That's pretty good. Okay, guys, I really don't like chocolate with mints, but Olive Garden somehow has it good. We're literally leaving the vanity room a mess. But we really have to go like right now. And I really think we should do an Olive Garden mukbang. Adios. Adios. A lot of people have been saying we say like a lot. Like a lot. <laughs> we can't say like, but if we do, we have to go to the next step. And I have to go to school. It's so hard not to say the word because I'm so tempted to say it. I got the new Glow Recipe Toner. The packaging is outrageous. Okay, let me see. That is so pretty, guys. Look. Okay, you know how hard it is not to say it? It's so hard because we say it all the time. Okay, I really like this. Eh, eh, <laughs> you said like... Oh, bro, I have it like right here. You can't blend it. You can't. <laughs> okay, we already started to a bad start. I'm not in the mood because I have to go to school. <laughs> Tell me why I have a huge pimple right here. How cute these pimple patches are. My daughter convinced me to buy them and I'm gonna put one on because this is so cute. It's B day and I have math and I forgot to do my homework. But haven't we all? It's me. You told me you did your homework. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it on the right to school. <sighs> okay, you know what I'm so mad about? I lost my front flash on TikTok. Like, they need to bring it back because, like, I need to use it. Okay, so, like, it's raining so hard and I hate that I have to suffer and I know after school it's gonna be raining even more. I realized you used the word like, so you can't, um... I used it. You can't curl your other side. <laughs> I realized I used it, like, three times. Wait, I just said like again. Okay, between the two of us, I think I'm winning. How can I go to school without mascara and the other eye curled? <laughs> it's hard out here. So we have to go, and it's raining outside, and I hate when it's raining, because I'm just awkward with an umbrella. <laughs> Okay, so I'm not in the mood, so in the meantime, adios. Get ready with us to go to the gym at 5 a.m. She's making me go to the gym at 5 a.m. And we're doing this before school starts. Okay, here's the thing. The reason I'm convincing my mom to take me to the gym is because I'm in my gym girl era. Why do I have to be in it? Because you're in it. Okay, I will say she's a runner. She's a runner. She's a rock star. So I'm going to be her cheerleader. 
because I don't go to the gym. My mom said yes to mukbang, guys. And I love to run because it keeps me fit and I eat a lot. Yeah, by the way, y'all gotta recommend me what, like, that's what we should stop by first. Okay, do girlies take their Stanleys to the gym? Because I want to take mine and I don't know if it's a thing. Am I the only person who's like a sweaty girl? Because I will sweat a lot. So I don't understand why we're doing this before school. So I could shower, duh. But your everything showers take five hours, and uh, we don't have time that for that for before school. Mom, there also is a Chick Fil A right next to the gym. Don't tell me that's why you want to go to the gym. Okay, this is what I'm wearing to the gym. And I need to put on my outfit because I'm in my gym girl. Era. I do whatever. Like I put whatever in the gym. This girl, she actually puts on a cute outfit. Okay, first I'm gonna wear these Adidas leggings, and then one of my favorite shirts this is Nike singlet. Okay, then I'm gonna use these Nike shoes that are good for like everyday run. We'll be back. Okay, I did a little mm -hmm. high ponytail, and the outfit is giving, y'all. Okay, I'm going to use some deodorant because I'm smelly. This duo from Rare Beauty mm, is the bomb. Hand cream. And then Rare Beauty hair and body spray. And then spray everywhere. Now we got to fill up my Stanley. Feel good, look good. Adios. Adios. Get ready with us to go to a quince. Okay, so it's my prima's quince, and we make big deals out of quince. For sure. It's sad to think that my cousins were turning 15, now it's her generation turning 15. I've been to quince in a minute, and I'm, like, so excited. I'm, like, just super excited because my cousins are, like, my best friends. I'm gonna see, like, all of them there. I'm most excited for the food. Quince food sucks, though. They have, like, your greens and salads. Like, I mean, it really depends, but this one's gonna be fire. Like, also gotta look good when the camera passed by while we're eating. They always do that. The camera turns on you with a whole entire food in your mouth, and you're like, her dances are gonna be amazing. My cousin's music taste is amazing. We're talking fashion here, so I'm thinking of wearing this dress because the theme is like pink. And I really haven't decided anything to wear. Uh, we gotta go in 15 minutes. Rushing like always. We always rush it. Not everything showers are forever. She is not lying. And I just got this new Tower 28 blush. Look how pretty it is. This kind of blush is every anything that is like super pink like this, I'm obsessed. We also have like three other quinces we're gonna go to because like all of my cousins are turning 15. I'm gonna use my favorite mascara, the icon itself, Tower 28. I really was gonna do a lot of makeup this quinceanera but i don't have time anymore but we have like three other quinceaneras to look good i'm just gonna use this one ring i got from claire's and it was like 7.99 and i actually went to claire's guys speaking of claire's i've been trying to convince my parents to let me get my second ear piercing it's like it'd be so cute to have two hoops i put on some earrings i got from la walmart I'm actually gonna put lip liner on you. Okay, we have these Summer Friday lip oils. One's missing because it's in my purse must have. But, but I, I think, think they would be perfect, perfect for the keys. I'm gonna do soft mom. And I'm gonna do blush drinks. It feels so nice. Let's take out my heatless curls. Okay, first one. Okay, Slay. Okay. okay, I think we're done, but I still need to go change. And we're still gonna be late. Adios. Get ready with us, but I need y'all's help to convince my mom to let us do mukbangs. <sighs> Here's the thing, I clearly like to eat. Really never seen somebody eat so much in my life than Esme. Okay, so like, I love food. Like, if you know me, you could just give me food gift cards. I don't care. Like, I love mukbangs. Like, I have a col whole collection of my favorites on TikTok. And I just want to be one of those girls. And I told my mom we should do a series that's called, like, Mukbang Monday. This girl has been talking about this every single day. So we did a sleepover video, and my mom was this close to saying yes because of all the comments. So I'm letting y'all convince her to do Mukbang Monday. Okay, so here are my go-to fast food places. First, Raising Cane's. Raising Cane's is the bomb.com. Y'all can't tell me otherwise. Second, McDonald's. I love their french fries. <laughs> and then third, Chick-fil-A because yum. Chick-fil-A, I won free Chick-fil-A for a whole year because I did this race. So we're going to be going there more often. I mean, don't tell me I'm the only one who likes mukbangs. Y'all see me eating in every video and I have a five-course meal right here. Oh my god, that's me. Let me just give my mom an example. Okay, so like I've never been to In N Out and I want to go so bad, so maybe we'll try that or Wingstop. Okay, so like comment some food emojis so we know it's a yes. Maybe, maybe. In the meantime, adios. Get okay, ready with us for this Texas freeze. It is currently three thirty, and Esme just woke up. Yeah. I mean, it's a holiday today, and night is young. I'm gonna play Fortnite. Currently, like seventeen degrees here in Texas, and I am dying. My personality cannot handle this weather, and I'm in a bad mood. I'm expecting snow so we don't have school, but, like, I tried to get something from the car this morning, and the car was frozen. But I almost forgot to turn on the lights. Like, we're losing our minds here. Like, I have 
a sweatshirt and then three shirts under here and this blanket and I'm still cold. Okay, if they make me go to school tomorrow, I am not going to wear my uniform. I'm going to wear sweats because I do not care. And I'm also really mad because I just got my nails done and it already fell off. Why? I don't even know why we're getting ready, but we just want to feel normal. We tried to go to the stores yesterday, but everything was completely empty. Like, not even bread. I just needed some bread. In Texas, we go, like, we go big. Like, if there is a little bit of cold, we're buying all the toilet papers in the world. I think they will cancel my school tomorrow because it's going to be, like, 11 degrees tomorrow. I don't know. I'm just not in the mood. I don't know how people are, like, so happy when, when it's, like, super cold. How do y'all do that? I know when it's cold, it's sopa de fideo time. Pozole, caldo de res, sopa de pollo. Like, my mom has it ready already. My grandma makes the best. It's the bomb.com. We're absolutely going to do nothing after this because when it's cold, we don't move. So, adios. Okay, guys, get ready with us for a sleepover. There's no sleepover. Okay, here's the problem. My friend invited me to a sleepover and I really want to go. But my mom won't let me. First of all, we're Hispanics and in the Hispanic culture, we just don't do sleepovers. By the way, guys, we're using this Mix Zoom Bean Creamer and this stuff is like amazing. Amazing. Guys. Besties, my skin has been looking rough, especially in the winter. And this moisture right here is so good for hydrating the skin. I mean, look how dull it is. I'm gonna get a small amount. I'm just gonna add this on. Instant shine. I think it has few ingredients like soybean, pomegranate, and barley and pear. And it gives you that long and smooth moisture. I really recommend this. Anyway. But I've known this friend since elementary. And I know her mother too. I just I just can't do it. I mean, I already have this cute onesie pajama. <laughs> and I went extra and got slippers. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. These are cute. And I need y'all to convince my mom to let me go to the sleepover. I got distracted by the skin. I mean, it's good. Do y'all have sleepovers? I'm not gonna let this go. But anyway, I mixed this moisturizer with the Mixun Bean Essence. Fabulous. But to be continued on this sleepover. What do y'all guys think? Anyway, these products are legit. Adios. Get ready with me for school, but we get to wear sweatpants for the first time ever. And don't judge me for eating dino nuggets for breakfast. This is girl breakfast. Kind of like girl dinner. Okay, we're doing the heatless curls again, and I think I'm perfecting it every time. But here's the problem with the heatless curls. She only can do it in the morning because she sleeps like crazy. Yeah, they just can't stay on at night. I have to use the closest and the glow recipe. Okay, so we're wearing sweatpants because it's cold. And I'm wearing sweatpants because it's basically what I wear every day. <laughs> I'm Adam Sandler in between us two. Okay, I'm wearing this Hello Kitty set my mom got me from Target, and I love it so much. Just look at the pants, the whole set. And the best part about it is they never let us wear Crocs. And we're wearing Crocs only for today. And of course, I have to wear my Barbie Crocs. I remember I told y'all my lunch is later because they changed my schedule. Yesterday we took a test and my stomach was grumbling and like everybody heard it. So Esme told me about it and I went to Target to buy her snacks. So that can't happen again. We have to eat a good breakfast though. Okay, the one thing I am excited for is seeing the Mean Girls movie later today. And if you want us to do a separate Get Ready With Me on that, we'll do it because we're going to slay. This might be my last day at school for a while. The thing is, it's like 75 degrees today, but then next week it's going to be like 11 here in Texas. They automatically cancel. But I hate it. It's like they cancel like an hour before school starts. <laughs> so we're getting ready and then they're like, no, school is closed. And we're almost heading out the door. I take off these heatless curls and finish my breakfast. Because we literally have like three minutes. Literally. Take I guess off. it's time to take them off. Okay, they actually came out better for only having it on for like 30 minutes. We have to go to take her to school and I got things to do. Oh, my stomach doesn't grumble this time. Bye. Get ready with us to go on a huge shopping spree. This is like a Sephora card and I know it has $500 in it. Okay, this one, I don't know how much it has in it, but we're going to find out whenever we go to the store. Okay, a lot of people have been talking about Sephora kids and yes, I am a Sephora kid. But here's the thing, she's a good Sephora kid. I mean, like I went to Sephora last time and I kind of, kind of felt bad because a lot of people were talking about how bad Sephora kids are. Okay, but... Back in the day, when I was younger, we used to have like Justice and like all these other young teen stores. But they all like disappeared. So where else are these gonna girls go to? You know, the moms are always going to Sephora, so they gotta tag along. Claire's is expensive, guys. Like, why would I go to Claire's when it's like just as expensive as Sephora but I could get better products? Then you just have to teach your kids to be responsible. And try not to annoy the Sephora workers either. I've gone to Sephora with her plenty of times. I have seen Sephora kids, but I haven't seen them act up. Okay, what I'm looking forward to getting at Sephora is like the new uh, Soda Hanero Bum Bum Cream. I also have it at Ulta, so I prefer you get it at Ulta because we could get the Ulta points. I heard it does attract spiders, but it also smells like a sugar cookie. And we know you like food. <laughs> and then obviously, I'm going to go to Ulta to see if they have those new e.l.f. liquid blushes because they're like all over the place and I can't grab 
any. And I know a lot of people like ordering online, but honestly, I don't really like ordering online. I like to like test them out. And it feels good like going to the store, getting it, and then coming home with your products in your hands. But that's just me. Yeah, also what I really, really, really want to get is the hourglass concealer because it's viral everywhere. And I just want to get my hands on it. Okay, I also got this new Makeup by Revolution highlighter. Oh my god, it might be my new favorite. Okay, I don't know which one to go first, Ulta or Sephora. Remember kids, shop responsibly. Okay, bye guys, bye. It's New Year's Eve and we're going to do a full face of makeup we're obsessed with. Like These products are coming with us next year, like in tomorrow. And we're going to be up to like 3 a.m. Hispanic household, what can I say? Let's get started. <laughs> we're starting off with Tower 28 to refresh our face. First off, my new daily obsession. This Glow Recipe Moisturizer, I love it. Oh, this is bronzing drops. I got the say one. This one is the best. I got the Drunk Elephant Goldie Drops, of course. God, I'm so excited for New Year's because they're making carne asada and it's the best. Hispanics do the best carne asada. We're going to make this last. We're using the Glow Recipe, what is this, Dew Drops? And also the Elf primer okay next is the elf halo glow i love this stuff it's not a foundation because i don't need one but it's that glow i love and if you know mario you know chris because we guys <laughs> okay me and my mom agree that tower 28's concealer is making new year's with us tower 28 came out with the best concealer all year Heck yes this is coming with us next patrick tall we love you patrick tall we love you patrick tall and we, we love, love you patrick, patrick tall we rarely use eyeshadow so we're just gonna put this all over the eyes this is benefit cookie because we like cookies and this is the best cookie we've ever had in our lives powder huda for the win one of the best setting powders out there in the game say bronzer you know what can i say what can i say about say <laughs> essence mascara it's like so affordable that even affordable makeup is still good okay for lips the best one i love is this ysl glaze lippies and i have the say and a very cute barbie pink next setting spray and this is gonna keep our makeup all, all night. night and this is the finished new year's eve look Happy New Year 2024. Now let's go eat some carne asada. This is part two of doing a full face of makeup spelling the word Christmas. So hopefully it turns out good. The letter C, we chose a Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Filter. It acts as a primer and also like a foundation for us. So we got a good head start. Okay, this is the scary part. I kind of ran out out of this. So I don't know if you're going to get any product. The struggle is real for Christmas. I'm so sorry. Next is H. We chose Huda Beauty Concealer because this is long lasting and full coverage and i really do need that for christmas i'm still struggling to get some product next is r for rare beauty because we have limited products so we're going to use it on the cheeks the eyes for eyeshadow and on the lips see one dot is all you need for this okay i think it's turning out pretty good this is i for Ilia. we got their setting powder look how pretty this packaging is okay this is looking nice i'm kind of happy this is s say for cream bronzer this stuff really is one of the best cream bronzers out there i mean i just want to open the present that's all you're excited about i'm excited about makeup next is t for tower 28 i've never tried their mascara but i'm really excited if y'all don't know tower 28 it's becoming one of my faves mine too okay tower 28 mascara is eating for real okay next is m for milk we got the setting spray look how pretty the packaging is ready spray next is a on the stage of brow is and i knew i was missing something and it was my brows because they were missing Next is S. We got the Sephora lippy, and the shade is so pretty. Oh, this is so pretty. pretty. These remind me of the YSL one. So pretty. And this is the finished Christmas look. Now let's just go open the presents. <laughs> we want to wish, wish you a Merry, Merry Christmas. Christmas. I hope y'all get what y'all want. Okay, guys, I'm doing my own makeup for Christmas pictures. This is part two. I'm trusting for her to do her own makeup, but this is really important because it'd be shown everywhere, even your grandparents who don't even have social media. Okay, the thing I'm most scared of is eyeshadow, but these eyeshadow sticks from Rare Beauty are like crayon. She needs something easy, so this is the only thing we have for eyeshadows. Okay, I think it's turning out good, Mom. Let me see, let me see. Not bad. I'm gonna go in with the L'Oreal Powder Blush, one of Esme's favorites. I mean, it's so good. She put her finger in it. Look at that. One tap. That's like all the powder blush up in here. Okay, to give it a Christmassy effect, we're gonna use this Benefit highlighter in the inner corners. Also gonna add it like here on the tips of the eyebrows. I mean, it just gives you that glow. Okay, next is mascara. I'm using this Essence one because they're so affordable and I trust it for these pictures. Guys, like, look at my lashes. Y'all need to buy them. Makeup is turning out so good. I'm so proud of it. Okay, next for lips, I'm just gonna go on with the clear lip gloss from Dior. And I got the e.l.f. one. The dupe one, supposedly. I'm gonna fix her hair a little bit because I have other kids to get them ready too. Okay, next is setting spray. This Charlotte Tilbury one is a must. 
best. Oh, I love the breeze on that. This is the finished look. I think I did amazing. Okay, Santa sleigh. Get it? <laughs> I really do think the pictures are going to come out so good. Adios. Adios.